Welcome! In this video, I'd like to show how to convert numbers from base 10 into binary. So, uh, this process will work for any integer number from 0 to 255. Uh, so, this will be a traditional way to convert integers into 8-bit. So, let's do the number 17. In order to convert this to a binary number, we're going to need our 8 bits. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then what we do is we write this, this sequence of numbers beneath each digit starting from right to left. So we'll do 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64. Let's see if I can squeeze this in here. 1, 28. There we go. You'll notice that the first number starts with 1, and then we double from there all the way to 128. Now what we do is we look for which numbers in this sequence add up to the number that we want. Well, in this case, that's 1 and 16. Everything else just becomes 0. And that's all there is to it. Let's do the sequence again with uh, 73. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then we're going to write our numbers. 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, uh, 64, 128. And then I come up with which numbers equal 73. Well, I'm get, I know I'm going to need 64. Uh, 73 minus 64 is uh, 9. Had to do that math in my head. So we'll, we know we're going to need the 8 and we're going to need the 1. Everything else becomes a 0. And now, finally, uh, I want to do one more example. Let's do 119. Let's do our eight digits. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then let's write the numbers beneath them. 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64, 128. All right. Uh, 119 is less than 128, so I know I'm not going to need that one, but I will need 64. And here's where you have to do a little bit of math in your head. 119 minus 64 is 55. All right, so 55, I know I'm, I know I'm going to need 32. Okay, so 52 minus, I'm sorry, 55 minus 32 is 23. So I know I'm going to need 16. And then... Um, 23 minus 16 is going to be 7, and so in order to get 7, I do 4, 2, and 1. And then everything else becomes a 0. So we did three quick examples in this file. We did uh, 17, and there's the binary sequence. We did 73, and there's the binary sequence, and there's 19, and there's the binary sequence. So here's the steps that we did. We drew 8 digits, and then we did 1 to 128, doubling each time. And then I mark the ones of the values that sum up to the number I'm looking for. And that's it. Hope you uh, gained a little bit of insight from this video.